Well, your wallet isn't the only one that's hurting from higher utility bills. News 18's Joe Paul reports about why Tippecanoe County is over budget now on electricity and natural gas. Yeah, this incoming cold weather means heating bills are about to go up. Utility costs have already been on the rise over the past year. Now, Tippecanoe County is feeling it. Well, it's going to impact us. It's just like the basic consumer, just like any other type of homeowner. Um, electricity prices are up. Fuel prices are up. Tippecanoe County needs $125,000 from reserves to keep the lights and heat on for the rest of the year. Lights have to be on and buildings have to be heated and water has to be pumped. Commissioner Dave Byers says the county is maintaining some new buildings, but he blames much of the cost on rising rates. We've added structures, i.e. the fairgrounds and things like that, which is also going to increase our overall total bill. All those things add up to your total utility bill. A state consumer advocacy agency says average Duke energy bills are $28 more than last year. Centerpoint energy bills are almost $7 more. Fuel costs have increased um, across the United States, not just in Indiana. Issues in Texas last year and the Ukraine this year have contributed significantly to the rising costs. A Duke spokesperson says fuel costs are higher than they've been in a decade, but there could be relief on the horizon. We anticipate we're going to continue to see volatility in the energy market, um, but we do think on the whole next year, customer customers may see a slight decrease over what they saw in 2022. Byer says county employees are doing what they can to be efficient. Like hopefully a basic homeowner. I mean, you're going to take care of your, check your windows, check your doors and try to conserve as best you can. I mean, I'm probably one of those good people. I walk around, I see a light on, I flip it off when nobody's in there. So, you know, you try to do the little things. Well, if you're watching this and you're worried about paying your gas and light bills, the Indiana Office of the Utility Consumer Counselor says to ask for help sooner than later by calling Indiana 211. Reporting in Tippecanoe County, Joe Paul, News 18.